And with Al's Midport of the round one of the ENG under 12s Youth Netball Premier League Northern Conference, Al's Midport, great day at the office, two games, two wins. First game was against Grangetown. They had you on the back foot for a very long time in the game. Yeah. Got to the final quarter and you went and got a very, well, it looked like a very convincing win in the end. Um, yeah. It didn't really reflect the match play. Uh, but all in all, what went well in that game and what didn't go so well. So let's start with why Grangetown were more dominant in the first half of the game. Well, they were they were more faster than us and they were more quick movement and I think our passes weren't good at all. Yeah. And what did you do well? Do well? Um, we we got into the space and we got in front of our players at the end because we knew what they were like and we knew how to play them. Yeah. Taking our so time. Was that the message going into the final quarter to get in front of your players? Yeah. And stuff? yeah. Any other tactical? Uh, Taking our time because we were rushing a lot. Yeah. Did, yeah. did you enjoy that intensity? Yeah. <laughs> Did you go into that final quarter nervous, thinking, oh, God, I hope I don't make a mistake? Or did you go into it thinking, um, this is what I'm here for? I want yeah. to, this is what we're, we're here. about. Yeah? We're here for it. We want yeah. to well, you got the win. It was a very good win. You went into the Trafford game, and you literally was a carbon copy of the Grangetown game. So Trafford were up, majority of the game, well, they, are, they were up, majority yeah. of the game, up yeah. to the fourth quarter, two points down, going into the final quarter, and you turned the game around again. So. Again, what were you particularly not doing as well up until that point? I feel like our passes, we were popping, too, we were popping it too far over too much, and it, we were just losing the ball. And, then, and our passes weren't hard enough for us. So, yeah. And uh, final, guess your insight the coach said going into the final quarter. Um, screw up, screw up. Um, well, no, she weren't. She was just saying like, um, try. Don't, don't try and do all these bad passes, try and work as hard as you can and throw the good passes and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, so what do you think? What was the main thing that got you to win there in terms was it was it your passing, was it your shooting, shooting act being accurate, was it your defence? Identify the, the pivotal part of the part of your play that got you to win. Um <laughs> most of the um our parents were like shouting at us and telling us, Come on, carry on and then we had a little prep talk and then we just started playing good. You know what, I'm gonna agree with you. Your parents are brilliant. They got you over that furniture night, so yeah. well done to them. Um, two wins out of two. You're up the top there with um, Olgum and who else wants it? Aguirre. They both won two games today. Seven games left, ten teams in the league. What is the aim this season? Win it. Win it. Win it. Yeah. You, you can take on a team like Oldham and beat them. Oldham. Yeah. We didn't win the Come on. Yeah, yeah, we're going to win them. We're going to win them. Yeah. <laughs> well, girls, really well done. And I think with your spectators behind you, anything can happen. So, yeah. well done, Elspeth Paul. We look forward to seeing you again in round two. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.